we already have lecture on menstrual cycle the link for that video is in the description now in this video we'll be discussing about the functional anatomy and changes in adult ovary during ovarian cycle the adult ovary undergoes several changes during the ovarian cycle which is a regular process of maturation and release of an egg in females these changes are primarily driven by hormonal fluctuations and occur in two main phases the follicular phase and luteal phase first of all we see there is a follicle maturation followed by ovum shedding and corpus luteum development now let's see these things in detail here we have the cross section of ovary it has got primary follicles in it it's acted upon by fsh that's follicle stimulating hormone and it starts growing into secondary follicle as shown in the diagram and most of the time this developing follicle leads into atresia and that follicle is termed as atretic follicle but there are few follicles that mature into tertiary follicles we see the follicle rapidly increases in size under the influence of gonadotropins to form the mature or graafian follicle after that antral fluid increases in volume and the oocyte surrounded by accumulation of granulosa cells in the next step we have the ovum shedding we see the mature graafian follicle ruptures and releases the ovum by the process of ovulation shown in the diagram after ovulation the graafian follicle develops into corpus luteum shown in the diagram and further this corpus luteum develops into corpus albicans now let's dive into the graafian follicle here in this diagram we can see the graafian follicle in the middle we have the fully grown oocyte it has got antrum in the center that's follicular fluid membranous granulosa cell theca interna and theca externa the granulosa cells surround the oocyte within the follicle fsh that's follicle stimulating hormone induces the granulosa cells to express lh receptors on their surface and when lh binds with these receptors the proliferation stops second important structure in this process is atretic follicle it's an ovarian follicle that begins to mature but fails to mature and this process is termed as follicular atresia approximately 1% of mammalian follicles in the ovaries undergo ovulation and rest 99% follow the follicular atresia now let's see the pathologies related to follicular atresia we have the premature ovarian failure ovarian follicular cysts ovarian cancer and pcos we see the dysfunction or dysregulation in follicular atresia leads to these pathologies so this is what the functional anatomy of ovary is and the changes during ovarian cycle i hope you like the video if you like it give it a thumbs up do consider supporting my work on patreon or youtube and make sure to subscribe to the channel thanks